Hey everyone, I'm King. Welcome back to King Spade channel. So the Lava Collaboration event is finally here. When the first time the game revealed that they will make a collaboration with the Lava, players have a mixed feeling about it, mostly feeling indifferent. This collaboration is not what players expected. The Lava is a South Korean 3D computer animated show. Its two main characters, Red and Yellow, Yellow are two lava who don't have dialogue, although they do make expressive sounds. Lava is a TV series that first aired in 2015 and after that had been continuously produced for several seasons every year. The latest is season 5, aired in 2023 and is still an ongoing series. And it also has a movie made called Lava Island the Movie. So it is a South Korean animated series and of course we need a Korean made animation for the ROX event to appeal the Korean players in the Korea server. Now that it is available in the game, let's take a look at the event in the game. Will it be an enjoyable collab like the other collab event previously? Alright, first off, the event is from 5th of March to 29th of March which is about 3 weeks or 19 days to be Zack acquired of a short time compared to the previous collab event which usually up to one month. There are three pages in the event interface. The first one is the event daily and accumulative quest. We see an introduction of new activities for this event quest that we have not have yet so far. Some of the daily quests require you to participate in the amusement park activity and ride the carousel mini train or octopus with your friend or partner in the game. Completing the daily quest, you can get the sausage event item, which is an item that you need to feed red and yellow. We're going to talk more on that in quite a bit. For cumulative quest, nothing that is hard to do. You need to do endless tower with your friend and reach certain floors, do instance with your friend, and not forgetting the exchange center diamond transaction. Looks like there is an extra reward for spenders. The next step is the lava feeding activity. The sausage item is used to feed the lava. You can get the sausage item from completing the event daily quest. So looking at the event daily quest, you can get at least 3 sausages by completing the quest up to 4 maximum if you can get your crystal transaction in the exchange center to 50,000 crystals. To get more sausage item to fit red or yellow, you can also get it from killing the monster with Odin's blessing turned on. There's no info on how much you can get or if there is a limit per day that you can get the item. But I had used 1000 Odin's Blessing prior to this video to test how much I can get and I got nothing in 1000 Odin's Blessing. So if you know how much Odin's Blessing you need to get at least one sausage item or if there is a limit that you can get per day, please let me know at the comment section below. To feed the lava, first you need to pick between red or yellow and proceed to the central fountain in Prontera to feed them the sausage item. The feeding activity is a competition itself. Who feed the lava the most? According to the little info here, there are three rounds of feeding in total. The duration of the activity is indicated by phase. The first phase is until 12th of March, so that is about 7 days. The next round might be after that for another 7 days. The players who feed the lava the most will get the event exclusive lava mount with a speed of 6. Although it has a speed of 6, but it is not a combat mount like the other 6 speed mount. Second and third place will get red or yellow lava pet cage. Now we have a new pet, two new pets from the event, red and yellow. Both are neutral element pet, with red have magic attack aptitude and yellow have physical attack and penetration aptitude. Both have the same pet talent skill and it is somewhat similar to the slime and freoni talent skill. It devours the target and if the target is a monster, it 
will be instant kill. If the target is a player, it will then spit out the target after one second. The pet skill is similar to the other neutral element pet skill. And oh, forgot to mention that the red and yellow pet is a purple grade pet. So there are three stars pet and have a percentage stat aptitude. The top 20 players will then get the lava mount gift pack, which when open it, have a 0.5% chance to get the lava mount and the lava pad. If you are not in the top 20 list, you still will get some rewards. Feeding the lava 10 times, you can get the lava token, which is used to exchange for the event exclusive reward. We're going to see that after this. And the winning camp bonus item, a consolation prize, which increase 500 points of weight for 7 days. And the last one, the pink's collection. Now pink is one of the characters in the lava animation. This is essentially the event shop. You can use the lava token to exchange for various rewards that this event offers. The event body and head costume, which you can see the look at the side here. There is also the lava doll headpiece, the event avatar frame, chat frame and sidebar, and lastly 4 lava movement actions. And that's it, a simple event just like the normal holiday event that we have in the game. There's nothing extraordinary in this event other than new costumes, pets and mount. Alright, that is all about the lava collaboration event. This time video shoutout goes to Thank you for always supporting me and this channel. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. And also, don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. By the way, if you haven't know it yet, the game will undergo a job balance very soon. And speaking of job class adjustment, the Korea server had implemented the changes together with the Lava Collaboration event updates, which the Korean players are also having the event at the moment as well at the same time. And my shotboat ranger is currently having a blast enjoying the changes. Just look how far the aim ball skill can shoot. So to know more about the details of the job balance, watch this video next. Thanks for watching this video and I'll see you on the next video. And as always, happy playing. Bye bye.